Okay, hi class. For today's assignment, you are going to find some object, any kind of objects, and divide them into equal groups. So today, my kids wanted to paint some rocks. So I thought, what a great way to show division. So we found some rocks here. Let's count them. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16 rocks. There are three of us plus my husband. So four people will be painting rocks today to figure out how many each pe person will be um, painting. You either need to know already what is 14 divided or sorry, 16 divided by four, or you could put them in four equal groups such as this one group, two group, three group, four group. Help me out guys. Everybody put a second rock in the group, third rock in your group, fourth rock in your group. This is so do I have four here and four there. Do you have four? Yep. You have four. four. 16 divided by four is four. So that's one way to show division. When we're done painting our rocks, we're going to have these delicious cookies. Yum. On this plate, I have six and six. So I have 12 cookies. Now my husband, as you know, dad does not like cookies. So we're just going to share them today, the three of us. So how many cookies would each person get? Okay. <laughs> no, I mean, if the three of us get the cookies, and you and Eliseo want the cookies too. How many would each person get? Oh, well, if you weren't here and uh -huh. me and Eliseo would just share, then it would just be, we'd both get six. Oh, so you would get six and you would get six because 12 divided by two is six. But there's three of us and I do want some cookies. <laughs> so Eliseo, if we broke this up into three groups, how many cookies would each person we'd get? We'd have four and four and four. Four and four and four because 12 divided by three is four. But in this case, you're both wrong because I'm eating all the cookies myself. 